Hello, YouTube land, and how's it going, my aficionado friends of the trombone? My name is Luis Fred, and starting this fall, I'll be Associate Professor of Music at UCF. I think that kind of has a nice ring to it. And, ladies and gentlemen, I've been asked by my dear colleague, Dr. Scott Luberoff, and my friends from the Florida Band Masters to prepare a video of skill sets that I can use to work at home that will help increase my efficiency in playing. I figured a good conversation we could have in this video is how do I go from slow slurs to flexibility in a way that's cohesive and that is fun. So guys, I'm going to set the metronome to quarter note equals 80 and what we're going to do is a three note slur by Mr. Schlossberg. So we're starting on tuning B flat to F to B flat in the second line. So guys, here we go. Okay, and one, two. Go ahead, play at home. Start from there. All right. slur that we're playing as one idea as a beautiful thread and notice that we're blowing through the phrase not at each note we don't place a three note slur it's choppy that won't help us out much there's a trumpeter his name is James Stamp and he saw the Schlossberg three note slur and he said hmm I'm sure we could make a beautiful melody out of that and he certainly did in his warm-ups so guys here we go Mr. Stamp's warm-up using Schlossberg three note slur. <laughs> Remington in the trombone world, he's known as the chief for many years. He was the trombone professor at the Eastman School of Music. And notice what Mr. Remington is going to do. He's going to take that three note slur, and he's going to take the first two partials, and he's going to make them into a flexibility. So. <laughs> skeleton of the three note slur is there but I want you to notice now we're gradually evolving into a flexibility study let's continue doing it together second position <laughs> Yes, absolutely. 
Absolutely. Now, Strasburg, Stamp, Remington. And now we get to a writer that I think is absolutely fascinating. Mr. Robert Marsteller. For many years, he was principal trombone in the LA Philharmonic. And he left us a great book. It's called Basic Routines. And in this book, he also thought about the three-note slur. But Mr. Marsteller realized, hey, what if sometimes we were to skip partials? And instead of going... <laughs> The idea of the six is something that other writers had explored before, but what is interesting about Marsteller is that he began to construct flexibilities around it. So how about we look at that three-note slur and how Marsteller actually cast it in, flexi in his flexibility study number 17. Whoa, that was fast, I know, but notice... the six has to happen with the same ease as if I was doing a three note slur. Now that is a very crafty way of building on embouchure efficiency with ease. Let's do it slow one more time. Here we go guys. Two and uh, oh. <laughs> When doing Marsteller, my recommendation is that you start slow and gradually increase the speed. Let's just go ahead and let's do this together. Just increasing the speed, just a little bit faster. Two and uh... Very nice. Take a bigger breath and now let's do two runs on that. Two and uh... colleague from Arizona State University, Mr. Brad Edwards, created a wonderful book that is widely used by us trombone professors. It's called Lip Slurs. And one of the slurs that I'd like to cover with you today was a pattern he created. Guys, I'm on page, what is this, 49. I want you to notice he built this beautiful jazz-like pattern, still thinking on the three-note slur idea. slurs we don't only have to stick to the slow kind of some some of you guys actually see it as eating your broccoli but notice if we have a beautiful connection doing the simple slur we can begin to build into something that's a lot more interesting guys how about we just simply take all the writers that we just covered and instead of seeing separate compartments out of things we begin to see the skill set as something that's cohesive. Let's start with Schlossberg one more time. Notice, 
Now, that the study of the efficiency of the embouchure utilizing a three-note slur doesn't have to become then just this repetitive grind of things. But you can start with the concept and begin to construct a cohesion from the slow slur to the flexibility where ease of production and health of your embouchure is preserved. Guys, stay healthy. Please, if you like more information about UCF, hey, but why don't you come out and check us out on our website of the UCF School of Music. If you like specific information about the trombone studio, don't be afraid to write me an email. Luis, L-U-I-S, dot Fred, F-R-E-D, at UCF, dot E-D-U. Everybody take care. God bless.